Hi, today's video is to explain why Boost Oxygen cans feel so light. Many people think they are empty. I've got two cans in front of me. They're both 10 liter cans. The one left uh, is empty. Press the trigger. Nothing comes out. This can, I'll show you at the end, is fully closed. Open up at the end, it's fully pressurized. So it has 10 liters of oxygen in it. This can has zero liters of oxygen. It's completely empty. So the empty can, mask aluminum can, weighs exactly 4.5 ounces. Right there. Take that off the scale. The full can, containing 10 liters of full oxygen, put that on the scale, and that weighs about five ounces. So the difference between the full can and the empty can is 0.5 ounces, which many people can not even discern. Um, it's you know maybe this with the weight of a few feathers. Every single can that gets produced for us goes through what's called a hot water bath. It goes into a container with a glass side and they're visually inspected and if there are any leakers, uh, the can would bubble. Uh, the can sits in the hot water bath for about 10 seconds, visually inspected, and then it moves on for the next can to come through. So uh, we are able to uh, ascertain without doubt that all of our full cans are filled with oxygen even though even though you they don't weigh anything and I'll open up the can now and show you the difference there you go this is the full can and you'll be able to hear the oxygen come out That with the full can, and that should, without the plastic, it should be a little less. Yeah, it's a little less than five ounces now. Now that I took about ten inhalations out of it. So again, hopefully, this will better explain how oxygen is essentially weightless. It has an atomic mass, it's very, very light, even 10 liters of oxygen compressed into a very lightweight aluminum can, has no discernible mass, that's why we put on all of our cans, that oxygen is weightless, full can is very light, so people can read that clearly. Uh, thanks, and have a good day.